What's up, everybody, and welcome back to another math puzzle. In this one, the question is to find A, B, and C if each letter represents a different digit from one through nine. And again, what we've got here is an equation or a sum that it must satisfy, where we've got these two digit numbers, A, B, plus A, B, plus A, B, plus A, B equals C, A. Go ahead and hit that pause button and see if you can figure it out. When you're ready, hit play, and I'll give you the explanation. So when we begin a problem like this, again, we want to be strategic. We want to look at what's going on and that will limit our choices for these options of one through nine. So for example, I see four two digit numbers, the same two digit number being added four times and we're getting another two digit number because remember C has to be a digit from one through nine. That drastically limits my choices because if A were three, right? 30 plus 30 plus 30 plus 30, whatever the one digit is, it's going to be over 100 when you add those up. And we've got a two digit sum, so that doesn't work. So that means that A can only be one or two. Now we see a second connection. I see that four Bs, when we add four Bs up, we get the A value in the one spot, right? It's not necessarily that four Bs add up to A, there's probably gonna be a carry. But the fact that four Bs are gonna add up to give us this A value means that A cannot be one because there's no way that four of any number is gonna end in an odd ones place. Now that we know that A has to be two, we can figure out what B has to be. And again, four Bs have to now end in a two. The only number where this works is when B equals three. The reason why three works is because three plus three plus three plus three is 12. So that gives us a two and a carry of one. Now that we know A and B, we can carry out the addition problem. Three plus three plus three plus three is again, 12 carry the one. And then one plus four twos is nine. And this of course means that C equals nine. I hope you enjoyed this math puzzle. And if you did, please click that like button. And if you want to see more math puzzles on the regular, make sure to click subscribe. Thank you guys so much for joining and I'll see you in the next video. Take it easy.